Hey guys, it's your Raven and I'm back with another video. So yes, your girl's back. Um <laughs> as you guys can see my hair is in like I was going for box braids. I did it myself. So let me know in the comments down below if you guys like my new hairstyle. Like I, I tried my best. It took like two hours. Honestly, it could have been better if I probably spent more time on it but like i could not be bothered i did it like late at night and i was like okay at the end i was just doing it i'm honestly most proud of the front probably but like if you guys were to see the back it's like looking not the greatest but um yeah i like it it's not bad i think i don't know i don't know i don't think it's that bad though but yeah hey so i have really good news um i just made another channel today for science-based videos it's gonna be like educational academic science videos and i know i said i was probably gonna post it on this channel but i was like okay this is my reaction channel i don't think people would really want to engage with like my science videos on my reaction channel so i was like okay might as well make another channel just based on science and i'll just like link it down below if you guys want to check it out i haven't posted any videos yet but uh feel free to subscribe to my channel to help grow my channel and uh just you know build the community before i start posting but yeah i look forward to posting on that account and yeah i don't know just like free plug if you guys want to check out my new science channel like i just designed it and everything and like came up with the name today so uh yeah i'll like flash it on the screen and uh it'll be down below if you guys want to check it out but um yeah i'm like so excited for that channel guys because like i already told you guys like i love science and like i can't wait to start like posting and stuff and just like honestly it's there to just like elevate and uplift people within the science realm who are studying sciences because i know it can be challenging and tough and um yeah so it's like science can be hard any subject is honestly hard and i just want to help make it easier for students <laughs> because i know how it was when i was uh studying and i still am studying so it still is very challenging but um <laughs> yeah okay so let's get into today's video so um today's video is just like a how-to video i decided to like show you guys how i make my reaction videos because i don't know maybe if you're watching and you're like okay i want to start making reaction videos too uh this is sort of just like a how to 101 make reaction videos it's pretty simple i use the software davinci resolve and i would say it doesn't really have a big learning curve to it like i'm going to show you guys how to use davinci resolve and um just how to compile like your video and then the video that you have on the screen because i remember at first when i wanted to start doing reaction videos i was like i didn't really know how to put the video also up in real time as i'm reacting to it and i thought it'd be good to share how i figured out how to do it. i just watched another video so on how to and then i learned how to and like i'm hoping this video will do the same so yeah let's get into it okay so first off you want to find a video that you like to react to so i'm just going to search up now I have a MacBook, so this is probably going to be catered to MacBooks, um, just in terms of, like, the screen recording, because when you are reacting to a video, you want to screen record your screen and uh, watch it at the same time, obviously, as your screen recording, so then you can upload your screen recording when you're in DaVinci Resolve. You can upload this video, which I record on my camera, and then I record a screen recording from, like, YouTube of the video that I'm watching, and then you can compile it together. So first, let's just find a video that we'd like to react to so let me just put type in like a simple video i usually react to music and songs so uh let's do central c obsessed with you i don't know it's really random but basically what you do is if you're on a macbook you can use quicktime player and open up that app and then there's a list of things you can do it's like new screen recording uh new movie recording so you can also like record videos <laughs> real ones know that's how i started off this channel before i like invested in a camera I used to record videos on my MacBook with the webcam and oh my days, the quality was just atrocious. But hey, it did what it had to do. It got the video recorded and I was able to upload. So yeah, okay, anyways, um, yeah, so you want to use QuickTime Player if you have MacBook to record. If you don't have a MacBook, I'm sure you can use like other apps that I will research and when I'm editing, I'll flash on the screen to screen record your screen if you guys are on Android. And yeah, so basically there's also a shortcut on MacBook where you go shift, command, and number five, and it will just pop up. And basically you click record, and now my screen is recording. So, uh, my screen is currently recording now, and I'm just going to 
just for the video's sake. Okay, so we're gonna go to Central Z. <laughs> Oh, this is his song? I thought this was Pink Panthers. Do you like them just for me? Alright, alright. I love when Central C says alright. Okay, so I'm just gonna start off. Okay, so you want to screen record your screen, open up DaVinci Resolve, and click on a new project. Make sure it has a title. Says if you edit your video and you forget a title and you don't save, you're gonna lose all your edits, and that is not fun. But it always reminds you if you do X out the screen on accident without a title, it always asks you, okay, do you want to save this video? And then you can also give your title of the video, whatever it is. I don't know. And uh, yeah, okay, so we're just gonna get into it. Um, pretty straightforward. I'm gonna screen record my screen and put it up here so you guys can see my real time actions. Okay, it's gonna be so weird because it's a screen recording inside of a screen recording, but okay, I'm gonna do my best. Uh, so it'd be much easier if you click spacebar really loud before you did your screen recording, which I usually do because then you can just take the, the sound of the boom with the sound of your video. And uh, yeah, so now it's kind of hard to like sync the videos, but as you can see, it's on top. And what I like to do, so shift command five, let me just record here. So, what I like to do for my videos, you know how I get it right here, you just want to click on the video and uh, you want to crop it right. So, here is like the cropping and transform button. So, you want to click crop first and That's for the video sake. Okay, so we're gonna go with, uh, let me just go. Here we go. So now you want to crop your recording so it fits the video size. There we go. There we go. Oh, that's a bit much. That's decent. And that's decent. Okay. And now I put it to the side of my video, like right there. So you can just drag and move it around. And then I kind of enlarge it so it's more viewable to viewers like you guys watching right now and then just to make it a little bit more realistic i like to sort of transform my background as well and just go like that okay okay and i feel like that's pretty decent and then the last thing I like to do is, since I screen record my screen, you also get sound on your video. But I also play the sound out loud because I don't use headphones, right? So, you don't want two audios playing because I'll just play that for you guys right now so you guys can hear what it sounds like. It's like two different audios, right? So what you want to do here is you want to go to your screen recording and uh you want to mute your screen recording essentially so usually uh let's get off of that okay so there you go so you guys can see that you just click on it and then you see like the two arrowheads popping up so you just want to do that boom mute and now if your video is synced it should be in tune with everything and your reaction is ready to go. Alright, alright. Okay, and now I'm gonna end my screen recording. And yeah, so after that your video is basically done. Um and you're free to export it. Wow, okay, that was honestly, I don't know why I had so many issues today, like, oh my gosh, like, I just could not, my computer started overheating, like, multiple times, it was just so stressful for no reason, like, at all, and I also want to record a reaction video today, too, so, wow, this is gonna be a lot to edit, because I have this, I have videos on this SD card now, and I have videos on my other SD card, so, 
just appreciate this video when it comes out guys please and thank you please drop a like and comment down below if this video was helpful i honestly i hope it was it kind of took a lot for me to do i don't know why it was that difficult but um you know i did my best and i completed it so i'm happy about that and uh yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video nonetheless and um please let me know other videos you guys would like to see me react to check out my science channel as well and follow me on my socials down below if you guys would like to see more of your girl it's been raven it's been your girl raven and i'll catch you guys all in the next video peace and love